Our approach to the science uh, of working with natural organic chemistry uh, and, and products derived from natural organic chemistry was really to, to look initially at what the chemical composition was. The process that we use to produce is unique and it does change the composition of the organic matter coming from the source material. What is it about the production process itself which causes these chemical changes? Because the key for us was we want to be able to make high quality product on a consistent basis and the only way we can do that is to understand what's causing differences here and make changes in our production process to make sure that we consistently produce high quality product. The chemical composition can vary and does vary a little bit from batch to batch, but not nearly as much as what we see in the source material or in other sources of natural organic matter. There are differences in, in, in biological responses depending upon the chemical composition. And what we've been able to do is, is find correlations between the differences in the chemistry and, and the responses that are produced in the plant. In the process of understanding the chemistry and, and how it affects biology, we were also able to identify new applications, new technologies, new ways to, to produce our product which will enhance the, the quality. And we've been able to take those discoveries and feed that back into the production loop and make sure that, that those get incorporated into future generations of our product. Once we've done that, we have to develop analytical techniques and procedures so that we can monitor the quality on an ongoing basis so it's a constant feedback loop to make sure that at the end of the day, the product that we produce is going to be consistent, it's going to be high quality, and it's going to perform the way that our customers expect it to.